my ninjas, I have the most mind-blowing information in the world. I probably shouldn't even tell you. What? what? Agent Peters, the FBI agent who stole Project Zorgo's body, is actually Chef Crouton. They are the same person. Wow. It all makes sense, Chad. You're sure? They're not just roommates, Chad. Chef Crouton has an accent. And Peters doesn't. People can fake accents. No, they cannot. It doesn't even make sense. Can Lost you? your marbles, Chad. They are the same person. Trust me, Allie is on her way over, and she's going to help me prove uh, my case. You invited my ex your over? ex-girlfriend. We were at Agent Peter's house yesterday, and look what we stole from his house. His what? FBI jacket. Oh. Remember, on December 31st, when Agent Peter's comes strolling, and hey, guys, get out of here. I'll take care of this. Don't worry. He was wearing this jacket. What size is it? Large. You know what else was large in his house? The chef's jacket. The chef's jacket was oh. hanging right next to this jacket. Impossible. Same closet. Same person. No, 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 no. No, they're just roommates, Chad. They're two different people. No. That's the FBI guys, and uh -huh. that's Chef Crouton. They share a closet. Okay. They share a closet. What, what two guys share the same closet, uh, right? What yes. if they're roommates? Roommates. Look, look at how it fits. Yeah, they're different sizes. They're, different. Different. they're two different. different people. No, I object. You're clearly wearing the jacket wrong, sis bro. No, I'm not. Is that why it I looks like a different size? Ask me why you have a button in the bag. What are you trying to pull here? A fast oh. one? Oh, Same size jacket. Whoopsie. Same person. Now, you guys think Agent Peters and Chef Crouton are all roommates living together? Is that what you're saying? Yes. Sure. Daniel, is that what you're saying too? Yes. We're all roommates. Yeah, we're all roommates. There's five of us here and we all live in the same house. Yes, we do. However, we all don't sleep in the same bed, do we? That what, what are you trying to say? One, there's only one bed in the apartment. Me and you sleep well, in the same bed. We're five people. Why would we all sleep in one bed? Exactly. So why would Agent Peters and Chef Crouton, would they sleep in the same bed? My Melvin stars. and Daniel sleep in the same area. No, they don't. Show them. Show them. Oh. They got their own jobs, they can afford their own beds. What if they're lovers? Exactly! Yeah, that's it, Chad. Okay, fine. Let's say that they do share a bed, but would they share the same toothbrush? <laughs> because when Daniel and I went into the bathroom, look at this footage right here, there was only one toothbrush in the bathroom. Uh. I think only one guy lives at that place. One bed, one toothbrush, one guy. Maybe Agent Peters uh, doesn't brush his teeth. Like, uh, yeah. Daniel does it, right? Cut this part, that's not true. The French, they do things differently. They Maybe they gargle. So Chef Gouton, obviously a chef, and probably owns a restaurant, right? Maybe. Oh, this is Agent Peter's jacket. Well, last night I was digging through the jacket pockets, and inside this pocket here <gasps> is a slip of paper. It is a ownership deed to a restaurant. Agent Peters owns a restaurant. What kind what? of FBI agent would own a restaurant? You know which one? One who's also a chef, a chef crouton. Eat that. Yes, Chad, wow. This is as official as those UFO videos that I've been watching that's been broadcasted all over the internet that the Pentagon is not trying to do anything about removing from the platform. It's totally real. They're not denying it. And you just wait when Allie gets here, she's gonna confirm all of this, that they're the same person. What kind of FBI agent would have a bunch of disguises? What? Remember, we found a wig and a, like, uh, whatever this is? Construction worker! Construction worker! This uh, guy is fishy. Chad yes. Wild Clay, the one and only Regina Genera, master of disguise. Oh. It's not weird to have wigs, Chad. Like you just said, Regina dresses up as lots of different characters. So does Agent Peters. He dresses up as lots of different people, including Chef Couton. Thank you for agreeing with me. And Chef Couton is his best disguise yet. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Hold up a second, y'all. FBI agents need to go undercover all the time. It would make sense that he has a little wigs going on. Okay. Exactly. Good point, Regina. Thanks, V. Yeah. Because you're proving the point that Chef Crouton and Agent Peters are the same person. Yeah. No. Why would this be at Agent Peters' house? Allie's wig ah. bag. Because the FBI agent and Allie are brother and sister. Allie is the chef's sister. The chef lives in the house. Duh. This doesn't prove that Agent Peters is the chef. Some of the juiciest evidence yet. Take a look what we found. You guys recognize this? Oh, snap. Bro. Yeah. Wait, Two so eggs. what? He went to the GKC school. Maybe he's an ex-hacker. So then, explain this. Well, we were like, hmm, why would Agent Peters have a GKC case? We opened it up to reveal 
It is a spatula! OMG! Something a chef would use. Yeah! Agent Peters is Chef Couton. Ay, ay, ay. Oh, what, do you, what do you think Agent Peters is doing with this, huh? Grilling up justice? <laughs> <laughs> I think oh, I know. Oh, yeah, yeah. What is this? A watermelon and a lemon? Argue with that, Chad. Uh-huh. What? Watermelon is a what, Chad? Fruit. A lemon. And a lemon. Fruit. There you go. You guys are fruity. No, Chad, these two items are both fruit. Yes. They're not the same at all. Okay. Chef Couton, watermelon. Agent Peters, lemon. Lemon, but they're still fruit. But they're separate people. Yes. yes. Then whose is this? It's the chef's spatula. Okay, good theory, good theory. However, when Agent Peters came home and saw that the hacker was messing with this spatula, he was like, hey, that is my spatula. It means a lot to me. <laughs> he got really mad. So this is Agent Peters' spatula. Why would Agent Peters have a spatula? Unless he was. A chef! <laughs> yes! Chef Crouton in one of our first battle royales with him used a spatula as his signature gadget. Why don't we just see whose fingerprints are on here? I think that's gonna prove my point. These are special dust. You guys, if you're not subscribed yet, you should take your phone, go up this way underneath this video. It's probably a red subscribe button. You should click it and make it turn red. If you want to be a spy ninja, I'll check it out and see who's subscribed to me. Less than half the people that are watching this right now are even subscribed. Are you one of them? See how many fingerprints are on this spatula handle. This is going to prove that Chef Crouton and Agent Peters are two different people. Nay, I say. That means no. Got some Look fingerprints, fingerprints on there. Put it on the reader. Okay, analyzing V. What's it say? There's more than one fingerprint on here? There is? There's more than one person's fingerprints? What? There's three different types of fingerprints on here. See? Okay, oh, hold up, hold he up. He lets everybody use a spatula. Hold up. Who has used this spatula? What fingerprints are on here? Well, your dirty fingerprints. <gasps> Mine? Okay, that oh. makes sense. I was just touching it. Okay, that makes sense. Two left. Who's the other person? This one's a little greasy. Extra greasy. Oh, it's Daniel's fingerprint. Yes. No, that's not my fingerprint. Yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah, you t you touched it over at Agent Peter's house. Oh, no. uh, who's the final and third fingerprint? Uh-oh. No. No way. What is it? What, no. is, what is it, V? Oh, oh, oh. Oh, what? Oh, I knew it. Oh. I knew it. Oh. Peters is Chef Crouton. Okay, that, that doesn't make any sense. There's got to be an explanation. Because Agent Peters was like, this is my spatula. Nobody touches it but me. Yeah. yeah. But, but there's no fingerprints on here except Chef Crouton. Which That's weird. Makes... That's really weird. Can we be wrong? Uh, maybe uh, Chef Crouton stole this and then put it in Agent Peters' case to frame him. No. It just makes so much sense that they're the, they're the same, same person. <laughs> Maybe Agent Peters doesn't have fingerprints. Oh my gosh, Daniel. You see this, Daniel? This is a lemon, okay? Yeah. <laughs> no. You're a lemon head. <laughs> hey. Regina, didn't we go to the FBI building just to find out that there is no Agent Peters in the database? He's not real. Oh, what easy. is this? What is this? Oh, this my is sanitary. Sorry. What is going on? Oh. Oh my gosh, you make points, Melvin. A lot of it, yeah. Ouchie. He makes points. Agent Peters doesn't exist. He wasn't on the FBI database. I said it. He doesn't exist because his real name is Shep Kutal. Whoa. Kutal. Oh, my mind is being blown right now. No, 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 no. It's not true. Really? I don't know what to believe. They have some compelling evidence. Where's the baby powder? I think Allie is gonna be here any second now. Oh no, I, I, uh -oh, I gotta use the bathroom. Before she it's gonna here. be four hours, I can't meet her. Remember when I was at Agent Peter's house, I opened up that microwave and I said, oh my goodness, what is that? A hamster, a guinea pig, a gerbil? No, it was a rock. Look at that. Oh! Look at that. Whoa! Whoa! So adorable! What is it? This proves it's Chef Kuta. How? Yeah, actually, Chad, I, I don't get it. I don't get this one. Okay, so you guys are still going with the theory that Agent Peters and Chef Kuta are two different people and they're just roommates, huh? 
Yes. All right, this is gonna really change your mind completely. So we got the hamster here, right? We got the invisible ink pen. I'm gonna go ahead and shine it onto his feet. Take a look at this, what it says, boys and girls. Hammy, my only roommate. This proves that Agent Peters doesn't have any roommates, except for Hammy. Yeah! No! So that means Chef Couton is not his roommate. That means Chef Couton is Agent Peters. I don't yeah. know. Gosh, I don't know what to believe anymore. Hadouken! Okay. The box of all the doesn't matter, Chad. Doesn't matter. Okay, Chef Crouton and Agent Peters aren't roommates. You proved it. Good job, Thank big you. boy. Thank you. Yeah. Thank but they're still two different people. That's why the chef was sleeping in the bed that one night. Maybe uh, what? Agent Peters was out of town and said, "Can you make sure nobody uh, burglarizes my house? Sleep over when I'm not home." Yeah, a house sitter. Yeah, bring a toothbrush. Daniel, you are in straight up denial. denial. <laughs> Oh, that's no. Allie. That's my ex. That's my ex. Speaking of denial, you can't spell denial without okay. Dan and Allie. Uh, sort of. Oh. Yeah! Uh. Go, open uh. the door. Allie's here, go ahead and answer the door. Oh my gosh. Uh, what are you supposed to say to your ex-girlfriend the first time you see her after you break up? Hello? Just answer I'm the just... door. Oh, hey guys. Come on in, Allie. Hey. Hi, Allie. <laughs> hey, Regina. Hey, how are you doing? Hey, me. Hey, Allie. Oh, I miss you guys. Hey, Allie. Hey. Um. <laughs> I don't know. Hey, hi. So, how are you guys doing? Come on in. Awkward. <laughs> that is super cringe. Here we have the lab detector test. Oh, yeah. I'm hoping you can okay. like help us. Are yeah. you sure Regina can't do it? I feel like she's really improved on her lie detecting skills. Oh, she oh, has actually. What? Yeah. Like, what? She's pretty good. When? when did she do that? I literally never. Oh, you know that one time. Well, I can probably do it. Daniel! <laughs> yeah, right? No. Yeah. Alright. Okay, let's just let's just do it. Allie and I see your hand. I'm gonna hook up this to your finger. You know the drill. Maybe someone else should just <laughs> hook up the finger to the okay. test, you know. Thanks, Melvin. Alley, test question. Just to make sure it's called pretty quick, correct, correct, we is Chef Couton your brother? Oh. Chef Couton? Yeah, uh, Chef Couton is my brother. That's part of the reason why we, we broke up, actually. We don't need to bring that up right now, Daniel. Is she telling the truth? Yeah, she's telling the truth. Now, Ooh. for the big question Is Chef Couton also known as Agent Peters? Chef Couton? You heard You him. know who Agent Peters is? Uh, Chef Crouton is... No. Chef Crouton is not Agent Peters. So they're two different people. You Let's heard see. my answer? Let's see if she's telling the truth. Okay. Whoa, okay, weird. It's inconclusive, look. Uh, Inconclusive, it says. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Maybe she was moving her hands. You must Let's be... ask again. Allie, you must Make be... sure your hands okay. are not moving. Okay, answer it again. Chef Crouton, my brother, is not Agent Peters. Okay, it's true. Whoa! We were right, I know! Yes! Wow. Oh, hold on, hold on. How come when she answered it the first time, it was inconclusive? There's something fishy going on here. Maybe it's not because you're wrong. Maybe yeah. Daniel's not reading it correctly. Yeah. Why wouldn't I not be reading it correctly? I'm the lie detector expert. I'm never wrong with this stuff. I've been doing this for years now. You must mash potato. Why is my mind mashed potato? No. It's mashed. Yeah. I'm thinking very clearly right now. You are a little uh, nervous. I heard you burp. He seems a little nervous to me. Have you ever seen this spatula? Mm. A spatula? Everyone sees spatula. But this exact spatula, have you ever seen this exact spatula? That exact... Stainless steel! Yeah, maybe <laughs> used by your brother. Have you ever seen your brother use that spatula? I don't recognize it. I've never seen that spatula. Okay, let's see what the lie detector test says. It says a lie! Oh, oh, you're lying, Allie! Yeah. That's because this is actually Chef Crouton's spatula because it is also Agent Peter's spatula. Ha <laughs> ha! No, 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 wait, 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 wait. I must have been moving or something, I swear. Uh, let's just try it again. Okay, Allie, next chance. time I'm gonna be watching your hands, okay? okay? Put them on the table. Me too. Have you ever seen this spatula before? I've never seen that spatula before. Oh, weird. Okay, now, now it says true! Oh, yeah. what is 
it! That's what oh, it was. Yeah. She was moving her hands, I guess. Okay, yeah. So she's never seen the spatula before. That she, proves our point. She would have seen it if it was Chef Croutons. Because they're brother and sister. Can you please explain why Agent Peters would have this? Ow! Shoot! And look. You got some blonde hairs in there from your blonde wig. Yeah, some of your droppings. Anyone can have a bag and anyone can write Allie's wig and put it in it. Get that away, Jay. Daniel, you know Allie the best here. Not really. That's why we broke up. Is this indeed the hair? <laughs> oh! oh! Why would Agent Peters have Allie's wig in his house? Your natural hair smells really good. Wow. You gotta tell me what shampoo you Yeah, we're gonna have to get it together. Yeah, oh, so Let her answer oh. the question. I don't know. This is one that I can't give you guys an answer. Read it carefully now. Right there. Why okay. Is the fan running so loudly on that thing. Okay, oh, whoa, oh, oh, whoa. Oh. Okay, she's telling the truth. Oh, it's her size! No, no. Melvin, that's not the answer I was hoping for. Wait, yeah, Wait. hold up, guys. Wait. She's like barely telling the truth. Like, she just got there. Slicing. So yeah, slicing. Yeah, that's what we want. Yeah. But she's still telling the truth. Just barely. Yeah, but it's still the truth. You got hair in your mouth? Ah. Uh, you got blonde wig hair in your mouth? Yeah. Gross. You used to like it. I told you it was what her hair. Heck? I told you. She just admitted that that was indeed her hair over at Agent Peter's house. Oh, don't air out the dirty laundry of our past. Let's just move on. Let's uh, go on about it. Okay. Does your brother, Chef Couton, own a restaurant? Chef Couton, my brother does not own a restaurant. Let's see if that's true. Great question. Smarty pants. Right here. Really good, V. Real smart. Yes. Is it so because the outcome of this test will determine if the business license we saw in Agent Peter's jacket is actually Chef Crouton's, based on Ali's answer. He doesn't own a restaurant? Okay, let's see. Uh, oh my gosh, guys, I'm sorry. What? Shoot. I don't know what the, it, the whole thing just froze. Come on! You need to charge Stupid it. Stupid laptop. I, let me just restart it. Thought I heard your computer overheating. I think it's working too hard. I can't even figure out if she's lying or telling the truth. I always told you that you have to keep up on your computer Allie, updates. Allie, don't talk about it right now. I, I'm just telling Listen. you. Okay, the computer's back on. Does your brother, Chef Kurt, does he own a restaurant? And say it to the hamster. You wouldn't lie to a hamster, would you? Uh, Chef Crouton does what? Are you sure? Ellie, what'd you say? <laughs> Chef Crouton. Oh, your brother? <laughs> Chef Crouton. Your brother? Does not own a restaurant. Mm. What? That doesn't smell like the truth to me. <laughs> All right. He doesn't own a restaurant? No. Let's see. Okay, here we go, here we go. All right. It's true! Ah! No! Oh my gosh. Is Agent Peters and the chef the same person or not? I mean, I came out here to help you guys. I hope this was good enough for you guys, but I actually have to get going. I have a date. <gasps> so, it was great to see you guys. I really missed you. It's good to see you too, Daniel. But Have fun on your date. Thank you. Bye. Yeah. Bye, Chad. I mean, bye. The What's the matter, Daniel? Didn't that go very well? Daniel.exe has stopped working. Let go. Now I'm gonna prove it to you. This is what gave me nightmares last night. Luckily, we've got Daniel's computer here. It's unfrozen. I've got some side-by-side -side imagery. Side-by-side! -side. Gather around, everybody. Gather around. Look at this right here. This is a picture of Chef Goudon. This right here is a picture of Agent Peters. Mm -hmm. Well, if we go ahead and we take that little chef hat off and we move it over to Agent Peters. Yeah. Look at that. Now, oh. if we take a white chef jacket and we move it from the chef over to Agent Peters. Look at that. Wow, they're looking real similar. Look at the height. Look at the body structure. Everything okay. is very similar. We used to blur his face to protect his identity. But now that he's a bad guy, let's unblur him. Oh, no. oh. Why don't we zoom in? Yeah. Let's zoom in. Yeah. Look at Chef Goudon's eyes. Yeah, yeah. Look at those eyes. Memorize those eyes. Okay. Now let me swipe over to Agent Peters. Look at Agent Peters' eyes. Whoa. Oh. oh. Side by side. Hey. Now the final thing. I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna take the Chef Goudon's infamous and famous. Handkerchief, scarf, and the bottom. Moving on over to Agent Peters. Drop it on. Boom! Look at that! Look at that! Agent Peters becomes Chef Crouton. Oh! oh my gosh. Wait, I gotta see this! <gasps> oh my gosh! Chef Crouton and Agent Peters!
Peter Peter are the same person! That's crazy. So Allie's brother is Agent Peters. That's so weird. Yep. So when Agent Peters went and investigated the PZ leader's dead body, yeah. that was the chef doing yeah. it. What? We didn't meet the chef until like two months later. Yeah, the yeah. chef was in our stinking safe house. Yeah. He's not to be trusted. So oh, he's faking the accent? He's not Italian. And the chef Gutan was trying to steal the leader's mask from our house and his gloves. Remember that? What? What is he doing with the Project Zorro leader's body? Okay, guys, this is all extremely good evidence, but not good enough. We need to go to the actual restaurant. If we can prove that the chef is the owner of that restaurant, because we've already found that Asian Peters is the owner of that restaurant, we know that they're the same person. Great idea, V. Tomorrow, yeah. Spy Ninjas at home, make sure to tune in to my channel to figure out if he's the same guy. Kick him off. Kick him off. Hey, this is what I said.